hello guys in this video we are going to use chat gpt to write an exam to see if it's really good enough now i'm going to write this full exam with chat gpt so we're going with the python examination over here so let's start the test so this is 20 minutes 30 questions let's go start so you can see this is a question so i will just head straight to chat gpt and then ask the question So you can see you use the command python or python tree so that's the answer now let's head to our exam and then python okay next what key do we use to define a block of code in python so you can see block of codes are defined using indentations so we are going with indentations over here now if you notice i can't copy text from this website that's why i'm typing it manually so let's go next which of the following data type is not supported in python string data type is supported in python you can see over here so you can see no there is no slice data type in python so we're just going with slice since that's not supported i'm afraid we may not be able to answer everything due to the time limit which of the following is a python tupu so you can see an example of a tuple over here so we're just going there this is an example since we can see the data type over here next user input is read as you can see floating decimal integer boolean value and text string you can see it's read as a string text string next so i'm just going to use a notepad to write this now i may not be able to finish these questions but let's see how far we can go okay so i think we we're able to answer 18 questions i will just let the time run out and let's see how many we were able to get correctly now everything was answered by chat gpt except the one i actually did myself why i was trying to rush up the time so let's see the results we got 15 questions correctly out of 18 that i used chat gpt to answer so about two or three were wrong and that was probably because of the way i asked the question to chat gpt but overall the accuracy is over 90 percent with this test so guys you can actually use this to write an exam and then pass successfully however this is just an experiment in the real world with real exam questions this won't be the same way however we could use chat gpt to learn and improve ourselves you can also try this yourself by simply heading to studysection.com and then you can sign up and try to take a test here. You can also use ChatGPT by heading to chat.openai.com and you can try this out yourself. If this was helpful, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.